So you might have heard that uh, Kobe Bryant used an derogatory remark towards the referee, anti-gay slur, or homophobic slur in uh, the game, Lakers game the other day. And uh, there's a lot of controversy surrounding this topic. I've seen a bunch of videos of people obviously not... Uh, you know, condoning this action, but also saying stuff like, you know, well, it was the context of the word, and he didn't really mean, you know, that by it. But it still means something. And the thing is, with. <laughs> there's still that history behind the word and using it in a negative way, okay? Because if you call someone a faggot, it, it's negative, and there's this negative connotation behind it, and that's going to keep fueling the fire of people having anti-gay views. And I know there's going to always be people out there who are pardon my French, but fucking stupid, who don't realize that people are born a certain way. You're not born, you're not, you, you don't just like wake up one day and choose, oh, I'm going to be gay today and tomorrow I'm going to be straight. Okay? Because the, if someone, oh, this is fucking stupid. That's all I'm going to say because, okay, I'm going to share a little personal story. Okay, and if this person's watching, I'm not going to use your name, but a um, good friend of mine, okay, he's gay, and he told me a story once about how before he came out for like two years, he prayed to God to make him straight, and I understand why he did that, because it seemed like he would, our society had made him feel like he was doing something wrong. Like he was, there was something wrong with him. And there's nothing wrong with him. And there's nothing wrong with anyone who is homosexual, bisexual, or heterosexual, period. Okay? Not everybody is the same. That's all there is to it. But when you have these words, faggot, that are used in negative ways, it has a history behind it. And if you continue to use the word, even if it's in a different context, it's still going to remind people of what it meant. And that's why it's important that we just don't use those words. It's just not right. So, I basically don't agree that even though it was out of... It, it was in a different context. It doesn't make it any better. Or not as bad. Or whatever. He doesn't need to be using that. Nobody, nobody does. Because it's putting down a whole group of people. That have done nothing wrong. And have had a lot of shit put against them. For the way they are. And. I don't know. I think America is getting better with sexual orientation and being accepting, but we're still the hell of a far away off from where we could be. So, I'm glad this story got coverage, because maybe, you know, it'll continue to feed the fire of we're supposed to be accepting. We're supposed to love others, you know, for who they are, basically. And, I don't know. This stupid shit like this pisses me off. So anyway, if you haven't seen the video, I'll put a link uh, below, and you can check it out. So, other than that, I'll talk to you later.